Hi guys, it's Mark from the SEGA 68 in France. Uh, the English version from this racetrack specially for six shooter and all the English speaking guys who follow the channel since a long time, Payne DRC, Wired SA and all of you guys. Also a special hi to Tamiya Legend. Here we have an FG1 fifth skill racetrack. Uh, it's normally a Matisse uh, or a Scania or DAF uh, because they make no French track body. So, with the help of this guy here, Alexander from Little Car Addict, it's a French guy who makes stickers, we made a French Renault truck. Uh, this race truck is on the raceway. It's, uh, you can see this truck race for real. Uh, it's clearly not a scale, it's just a looking scale. And we still have, because here by Erziger 68 in France, we are not serious guys. We have also not serious sticker. We have here Fritz the Cat, we have here <laughs> special made for me, this one. And my special logo from Alexander, a brushless motor who fights with an... Uh, uh, two-stroke <laughs> because we have no two-stroke here we have a killer motor we have here an SSS motor I don't know these motors I want to test it so I have buy one I take so low KV um, because it's for the truck for have the same uh, feeling like the real racetrack it's a uh, really massive torque but not uh, extreme high speeds we drive here 12S with the ZTW Pro Beast 300 amps ESC. Uh, we have the stock gearing from the petrol version here for testing. Um, I have just make a quick test in the street on a wet surface. Uh, this thing is amazing to drive. Uh, what you do on the throttle is directly uh, put on the road uh, with this motor. Uh, we have here 10 mm shaft who goes out of front motor so I can use the FG stock gearing system with 10 mm for a petrol version. This motor is okay to go to uh, up to 60 or 20 S. We are gonna begin with 12 S. For sure what happens, I think so, f 65 kilometers an hour. Uh, it's not much but it's what uh, the petrol version does stock and we will see uh, what is with runtime so i'm really excited to go drive this truck uh, it's for the weekend but i have no time this weekend but that's how air support goes so i'm excited to drive it and i'm now waiting next weekend so i have to wait seven days to can race this truck on the on the on the ground and it's uh, just uh, ah, I want to drive <laughs> I don't can explain you uh, what is the feeling uh, this truck is 11 kilograms uh, 22 24 pounds and it drive like a 110 skill 2s truck it's just uh, a blast to drive even on a wet surface so I can wait to have a, a dry a nice on road uh, Maybe I don't know, don't go to the racetrack. I will test, uh, make the first uh, test on the parking here next door. So, if someone of you have this FG, uh, it's just a truck version here, but it's clear it's the same than the, uh, the GT version. This is a 530 millimeter wheelbase. Uh, Ask me what you like in this truck, what you don't like. I have put in in the front a self-locking diff from FG, uh, so I can uh, go harder out of uh, the curves because I have here enormous traction to put on the ground. So I need uh, some stuff to put this power on the ground. Uh, so if someone of you have tested this uh, differential on this thing, I uh, wanna know what your feeling is about it, if you like it, if you not like it. I do this paint job because uh, we have only the stickers here. The rest is all paint job. The red here is paint job, the gray, the black. With my new airbrush I present last time and someone uh, tell me 
these airbrushes are not good the, the, the pistols have many problems but this is the tenth body I paint with this new airbrush system and I have really absolutely no issue with my uh, uh, airbrush system uh, it works really cool but what I do, unlike many people, I don't put my airbrush in the uh, in the cleaning bottle with the product. I every time I make a paint, I go to wash because I use water paints from Palmer to wash and and put um, how to say I disassemble absolutely the whole airbrush, cleaning with water and put it together. And this is why I have really no problem, no issue, and uh, it just works super. I have made here gray, black, and red, and in absolutely no parts from the paint job I have any problem. The paint job is just... Uh, I'm happy with the job I done. I'm not going to say it's perfect, but um, I have really straight lines between uh, the black, the gray, and the red, and I have uh, no nothing really nothing in the surface from the paint uh, on all the track I have a super smooth and clean paint so guys have a nice day hope to see you again uh, soon with this truck on the road bye guys oh I don't find the knob to cut off the camera <laughs> sorry I'm blonde <laughs>